broadcast live. It's Ginger Trill, the nobody, you know, interlude. Just amazing, you know? That to me is, has, has the potential to be verse of the year. It was, it's just, you know, you know, when it comes in and just the flow, the structure of it, you know, he hits the, he hits the snare with almost every word. It's just so masterful, man. It's, 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 that's, I think, Ginger Trill at his best, you know, uh, no corny lines, um, you know, just talking his shit. Um, so yeah, that's, 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 that would be my list, man. I don't want nobody fucking with me in these streets. Hello everybody, my name is Ginger Trill. You tune into Behind the Bars. I'm about to get my breakdown game on about the Nobody Interlude, which is featured on Gang Tapes while you want. Alright, so it go like, the mother niggas ain't as hot as this. You know my style legit. I'm pricey with the feature, need them boity kind of deals and pressure turn me to a polished diamond, you can count on me. I'm styling on these counterfeits while trying to count the chips. So, ain't much to this verse really. It's just like really long <laughs> and it's got a really dope flow. But most of the stuff I say there is pretty much forward, straightforward rather, you know, I say, I'm basically, you know, like, like, you know, rap is all about, you know, braggadocia and whatever. So I come on and say, these are the guys on this dope. That's the first stanza. That's what I see coming out the gate. You know, play on, you know, you know, count on me, you know, counterfeit, counter chips. It was just a way to show you that, like, I could use the same word, like, and, and break it down. Because how I rhyme is I break down the syllables, like, and then see how many of them I can rhyme per word and then just take it with every bar and then you know yeah Need my pockets fed about a bitch I need my wallet thick as Nadia got a squad of riders we ain't about the politic look away passes and it's like we don't know how to miss 99,000 problems I ain't tripping by the bitch so <laughs> I got this line on Forrest Guap where I say if I made a hundred with the feds know about it it's like it's we talking about we talking about like you know uh, getting, getting, getting like you know like dope deals and a lot of money so Hundred always seems like you know the, the, the nice number to round up to. So it's like instead of 99 problems, but a bitch ain't one. It's like 99,000 problems. So I ain't tripping about a bitch. It's not even 90. It's like it's 99,000 problems. So I'm not even tripping about a bitch. I ain't sleeping, not a wink. Everybody knows that's the motto. No sleep. I'm no sleep gang. I ain't sleeping, not a wink. Since I got it, this is not a trick. I simplify it. It ain't tricking if you got this shit. I'm an urban legend, not a myth. I'm fucking proud of it. I ain't gotta pick a style, but they ain't got a style to pick. So it gets a bit real there. It's like, no sleep. I ain't sleeping, not a wink. Since I got it, it's like, I have it. You know how the saying goes, it ain't tricking if you got it. So it's like, uh, since I got it, this is not a trick, but then I actually do the trick. I'm like, I simplify it. It ain't tricking if you got the shit. I'm an urban legend, not a myth. I'm fucking proud of it, you know? And I can do so many things. When I say I'm an urban legend, I can do so many styles. I'm like, I don't have to pick a style. I don't have to pick a side. I don't have to pick, but you don't even have a side to pick because you don't have options. That's how that stanza goes. They ain't got a sign of pick and I'm the one who got the any moment I can flip and niggas got a lot of lip but don't know how to plot a lick. Niggas switching up their stories cause I gave the plot a twist. That's also kind of self-explanatory. Um, if you don't know what to hit a lick is, it's when you, you know, when you, when you plan a project, so to speak, when you plan a project and it's really dope and you, and you get the money, you get the money, it's like you get the bag, you secure the bag, you know, that 250k hustle, that half a mil hustle, you know, like, that, that, that three quarters of a mil hustle, that's, that's a lick, I say, cats don't know how to plot a lick, but they always got a lot of lip, it's about how a lot of cats, I always have opinions about other people's projects and other people's moves, but when you look at what they do and they're the ones who really ain't doing nothing, you know, and I say, uh, you know, I, I've got the sound, I've got so many styles, I've got so many variations, I could do a lot with it. Next season, catch me in designer kicks. Meeting with my lawyer, reading clauses in the finest prints. But I say it funny because it's like, 
Catch me in designer kicks, meeting with my lawyer, reading clauses in the finest prints. You know, like fine prints, but also like dope prints. So the one that gives you a heads up is like designer kicks. Where could he be going with designer kicks? Then finest prints. Prospects like a college kid who got a scholarship. My condition kind of mint, got the Mayo condiments. Prospects like a college kid who got a scholarship. My condition is kind of mint. I got the mayo, condiments. Fuck opinions, fuck a comment, cause the sauce just got a drip. Fucked up comments, buying shit that probably cost about a brick. Yeah, I'm flossing, I'll it. It's for the culture. And that's just me playing like with the flow now, showing you, like just doing like an overkill, cause the rhymes, the rhymes are just compacted. And it's like a lot of rapid fire, because the syllables match so well, so it's like, it makes you think, whoa, it's like a wow effect. I like using those tricks to just like grab the, the listener's attention just a little bit. And I'm like, I show you Trilly kick the fly shit, I'm not the one to try it with. Back and forth across the country, peep the tech, ride a bitch, need a check as big as Ricky's, peep the threads and hide your bitch. I remember how my teacher said I won't amount of shit, but I made it all for ramen, never had to try and fit into skinny jeans. I know you see my wallet bulge a bit, what's the fucking budget? Kinda like the way this product fit. Up the fucking budget, need to cut my kid a lot of things. Wanna send him back to crashing some Balenciaga kicks. So I don't want nobody. But the most important thing about the verse, cause it's the 32 bar, is like I stay within the same range of like rhymes. Like the vowel might change just a little bit, but I'm literally rhyming pretty much the same words all over the track with like a couple doubles and multis here, all over the song in 32 bars, non-stop. And I hide a couple, you know, punchlines in there, but it's light work. It was mostly to focus on the flow, to let everybody know that this year, I do not want anybody fucking with me in these streets. Y'all niggas can, can, can talk about you designed that sound and you did that. Can this year do not step up to us talking about rap, okay? La Liga's coming back this year. You don't know what La Liga is, do your info. You just check Ginger Trill out on Behind the Bars, the Nobody Interlude. Broadcast Live.